metagenomic in archaeology is the analysis of all genetic material recovered from ancient samples containing DNA from multiple organisms. Rather than focusing on a single species, this approach investigates complex mixture of DNA derived from diverse microorganisms, often including human, bacteria, fungi, plants, or animals. In contrast to modern genomics, we typically use high quality intact DNA. Ancient metagenomics deal with highly fragmented, chemically altered, and environmentally contaminated DNA. As a result, stringent clean laboratory protocol and specialized computational methods are essential to authenticate ancient DNA from modern contaminants and to reconstruct genomic information from incomplete and damaged sequence. Ancient DNA extraction is performed in dedicated clean room to minimize contamination risk. Samples such as born or teeth are first cleaned to remove surface contaminant and then ground or otherwise processed before incubation in a lysis buffer containing EDTA, proteins K, and other agents to release DNA from the mineral matrix. The extract DNA is then purified using silica colon or magnetic bead, which selectively bind short DNA fragments. Given the degraded nature of ancient DNA, specialized library preparation techniques are employed, often using partial enzymatic repair of damage, such as UDG treatment. Prepar libraries are sequenced using high throughput platforms like Illumina, which are optimized for reliable processing of short read DNA. The resulting sequence data undergo a rigorous bioinformatic uh, analysis, including quality filtering, damage pattern, authentication, mapping to reference genome, and taxonomic assignment. This analysis allow researchers to identify organisms of interest. Ancient DNA can be recovered for a wide range of archaeological sources, like soft tissues, such as mummified remains, mineralized tissue, like bone, teeth, dental calculus, or coprolite, but also plant remains, insect, feather, eggshell, wood. We can also find DNA in artifacts made of processed biological material such as parchment, pottery, and bishtar, and finally from environmental samples such as sediments, high score, or lake core. DNA do not preserve indefinitely, and certain environmental conditions such as extreme pH, oxidation, humidity, and microbial activity greatly accelerate its degradation, making DNA recovery unlikely. However, under favorable conditions, such as cold, dry, and stable environments, DNA can persist for exceptionally long period. In rare cases, DNA has been successfully recovered from specimens dating back up to 2 million years. Ancient DNA is a powerful tool for exploring the biology, culture, and environment of the past. It helps reconstruct population history, revealing migration, admixture, and relationship between extant hominin and modern human. Analysis of dental calculus and coprolite provide dietary insight and highlight ancient microbiome composition and health condition. Ancient pathogen can be detected in human and animal dental pulp and bone, providing insight into the evolution of diseases such plague, malaria, or leprosy. Genetic data also reveal adaptation to environment and diet, like genetic variants associated with lactose tolerance. Additionally, DNA from burial sites inform on kinship or social structures, and environmental DNA from sediment or ice core reconstruct past ecosystem and climate. Together, this information complements archaeological data to deepen our understanding of ancient life.